Okay, so I think we're live here. We are at uh, Pep Boys in Manchester, Connecticut, and we're getting ready to find a ham radio Fox box, a hidden transmitter. Um, so for those of you who aren't regular subscribers or who haven't been following my channel, um, my local radio ham club, my ham radio club, has been putting out hidden transmitters out in the wild and those of us who have the capability have been trying to go look for them. Uh, so my son and I have found three of them so far. Actually he's found all three of them once we got to the, the final location. Um, and we've been having a lot of fun with that especially in the current kind of situation with C-19 and, and lockdown and, and all that kind of a thing. Luckily here in Connecticut all of our state parks and most of our town parks are still open. For, uh, for business and that kind of a thing. So we can get out and kind of get some fresh air. Uh, so we thought we would come out today and try and do a fox hunt live for all of you guys to see in real time. So uh, we'll apologize ahead of time if the video gets shaky or the, there's a lot of wind noise, it's kind of windy out today or if the signal drops or any of that stuff. The video quality isn't gonna be that good because we're doing this just on my cell phone. Uh, right now we are connected to Wi-Fi, so the signal should be good, but once we get out in the field, we'll probably be on the cell network, so I'm not sure how that'll work. <clears throat> anyway, we're at the starting location now, and we were able to raise the Fox Box. Um, so for those of you who don't know, there is a, sort of an email reflector uh, where the hunters can post information about the Fox Boxes as they try to find them and somebody posted this location as the starting point so this is where we headed out now surprisingly enough the signal was pretty strong so uh we thought maybe it would be a little weaker here than it is but it's actually pretty strong we don't even need to put our directional antenna up at this point we're close enough to key it up with our ht so why don't you key up the fox here and let everybody hear it so that they know we we're, we're sort of close. Okay. Well, it didn't work for me a second ago. Come up here. Come up here and try it. We can key it on the big radio if we need to. Huh, didn't work. Okay. Let's try Locked it this way. There. What's that? Over there. Yeah, I know it did. There it is. Okay. So hold that up so that people can see it. So there's the signal strength. Now, again, on the other side of the parking lot, we were able to key this up. and He might have just been holding it too low. Uh, yeah, actually, when I bring it down here, the metal of the truck is kind of hiding it. But you can see right there on the HT, the signal is pretty strong. So there's a few possibilities here, uh, I guess, that we could uh, um, kind of consider. Oh, I can see some chat coming through there, so I think that's James Bowie. Hello, thanks for uh, stopping in there. Um, I'm live streaming on the cell phone, so the chat only comes up for a few seconds, so I apologize if I miss your, your comment. Anyway, so you saw that the signal was um, fairly strong on the HT right here. Uh, so anyway, a couple of possibilities. Manchester Community College has a bike trail and some parks and things like that. And that's about maybe half a mile sort of to my left over that way. We could go over there, although I feel like if we're hitting it with the HT, we're a little bit too close. And there's Juddy. How you doing, Juddy? <laughs> it's good to see you in there. Thanks for stopping in this morning. The other possibility, we kind of looked at the map and we can also see it on the other side of the parking lot. There is a cemetery <clears throat> right over there. So there's a possibility that this thing could be in the cemetery. Um, so I'm not sure if we wanna go on foot and just walk over there now, or if we wanna drive over to the community college and see if we can find it there. I saw just in time pop up there on the chat. Thanks for, for stopping by this morning. Um, so, like I said, I'm not sure. What do you think we should do? Should we check out the cemetery first? I feel like the cemetery. You feel like the cemetery? I kind of do, too. Let's, I think what we can do here, if we can stay connected to the Wi-Fi, maybe we should hop out and go in the parking lot, key it up with HT like we do, and use our body as a shield 
and see if we can figure out a direction from there. Because that'll help us determine if we want to go that way or that way. What do you think? Mm -hmm. All right, let's try that. So let's see, guys, if I'm going to lose the um, stream or not. Oh, let's see. Tim Clark is in there from South Africa. Wow, thanks for stopping in. <laughs> We're doing a little fox hunting here this morning in Connecticut. So why don't you grab this and uh, see what you got. I'm going to meet you on the other side of the truck, okay? okay. I'm going to disconnect this from the battery. We're going to hop out. Hopefully I don't lose you guys. It seems like the stream is pretty solid at the moment. But uh, let's see what happens. Like I said, this is probably going to get shaky. And um, I apologize for that now. But like I said, we wanted to try this real time. See if we can pull it off. Let's see. Okay. So we're here in the parking lot of... Let's see, Pep Boys, you can see that behind me there. So go ahead and key that up and then do your um, do your thing, see if you can find a direction. Tell me which way we should go. So I don't know if you guys can hear it, but he's got the Fox Box activated and he's spinning around to try and use his body as a shield to see if he can determine which way we should go. That way think? and that way. Really? So that way's five, that way's five. So both the college direction and the cemetery direction are giving you the same signal stream. Yeah, Maybe we should over walk there. over here and try it again and see what you get. Try it one more time. Wait, wait, wait. There's cars could be coming through there. <laughs> so uh, come over here. Get away from the truck a bit. Let's see if we can do that. Yeah, get up on the grass. Good idea. All right. Did you lose it? Oh, and I'll step that away way. from you. Wait, Try it what? again. So you think towards the cemetery? Yeah, that's where I'm looking for there. Okay. So let's head back over to the <coughs> truck here. Um, so again, if you guys are just joining late, we're doing a ham radio fox hunt here. We're in Manchester, Connecticut. And uh, we've come to the point at the what the email reflector said was the start point, which is Pep Boys here in Manchester. We thought we were going to need to put my Yagi up on the roof and get a bearing, but we're so close here, uh, we can key the thing with the HT already. So that tells me that uh, we're in the area, and we're just going to use the technique that my son just showed off, where we use our body as a shield and kind of spin around and get a bearing that way. So we've got two options here that we're kind of considering at the moment. One is the community college, which is down the road over there about a half a mile. And then the other is um, uh, sort of cemetery. this way, there's a cemetery over there, which could possibly be a location. All indications point to the cemetery at the moment. So we're going to head over to the cemetery. Um, so what we'll probably do is drop the live stream here now. We'll head over to the cemetery, get set up, and we'll reconnect to the live stream. But I'll hang out here for a minute in case anybody's still in the chat. I really can't even see the screen. It's so sunny out here at the moment. But why don't we hop back in, you get buckled up, and we'll head, we'll head over to the cemetery. It's just a, just around the corner. Uh, let's see. I thought I saw Kyle pop in there. How you doing, Kyle? Thanks for stopping in this morning on my little experimental uh, live stream here. But uh, anyway... I guess, what do you think? We'll head over to the cemetery? Yep. Okay, sounds good. And let's see. Uh, somebody else says the cemetery, too. That's his vote. Stuart says that. Okay, so we're going to head over there. Um, I think what I'll do is just before we head over there, we'll check the map one more time to make sure there isn't some little hidden park or something over here. <laughs> I'm not super familiar with this area. Um, like I said, I know there's community college with bike trails and whatnot over that way, and then this little cemetery, but... Maybe there's something else hidden that we don't know about. So everybody, um, thanks for stopping in here. And uh, we should reconnect here shortly. Uh, if you've just joined the live stream, I'm on Wi-Fi right now, thanks to Pep Boys. Uh, but when we get over to the cemetery, we're gonna have to rely on the cell phone network. And I don't know if it'll be as solid over there. So I uh, bear with us if this gets shaky or choppy or whatever. <laughs> But uh, anyway, let's see what we can find over at the cemetery. I'll catch you guys in a few minutes once we get over there and settled. Uh, and again, thanks for stopping in and joining us on our 
Fox Hunt this morning.